I'm Patty Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to draw a Spanish conquistador. I take three fingers in the center and underneath I put a dot. And from that dot I'm going to draw a little curved line. I come back over here on the left and I draw slightly curved line down, curved line out, curved line down, curved line up and stop. Come over here on the right hand side and I'm going to draw a curved line down, curved line out, up, slightly curved line in, connect. I come back to the left and I'm going to draw a curved line out, curved line down, connect. Come up to the right, curved line down, curved line, connect. Come back to the left and draw a slightly curved line in and up and add one, two, three baby circles if you have room. Okay. Now come all the way back up to the top and right here we're just going to draw a curved line out, up, come down to this section and we're just going to draw a curved line down and out. Come back to the first line and draw a wavy, wavy, wavy line. And then a wavy, wavy, wavy line. Connect. Come to the second one, draw a wavy, wavy, wavy line out, down, and connect. Okay? Now I come back over here on the left and I'm going to draw a straight line down, curve line over straight line up, connect. I'm going to come back on the left right here and I'm going to draw a curve line down on the left and a curve line down on the right. Come back to the left, draw a curve line out and connect on the left, jump over, curve line out and connect on the right. Come inside and we're going to draw a big curve line up down on the left and a big curve line up down on the right. Come back to the left and just draw a straight line curve line on the left and color this in black and draw another straight line curve line color it in on the right. Come in the center just draw a straight diagonal down curve line straight line. Come right here in the center, curve line down, up, connect on the left, curve line down, up, connect on the right. Directly underneath, straight diagonal down, straight diagonal up, connect. Okay. Now come over here on the left and we're going to go curve line out, in, out, in, out, in, out, in, and up. Leave this floating. On the right, we're going to do it again. Curve line out, in, out, in, out, in, out, in, towards the center. Leave that floating. Right here, we're going to put a little baby circle. And then we're going to draw a straight line down, out, down, in, down, in, I mean up, out, up, in, connect. Okay? Now come back up here on the left and we're just going to draw a wavy line, connect on the left, wavy line, connect on the right. Come back again on the left and just draw a wavy line off the page. Come in about here and we're going to draw straight diagonal out, straight diagonal down, straight diagonal up, connect. Now we're going to draw that again. Straight diagonal down, over, up, connect. Okay? Now come right about here and we're just going to draw curve line down, come up a little bit further, curve line down 
off the page. Inside, right here, we're just going to draw some cur slightly curved lines up, over, and across. If you have room, okay? Now, come all the way back up to the top. Watch what I do. I'm going to draw a curved line up, slightly curved line out, curved line down, curved line up, little curved line, straight diagonal down, curved line up. Put a baby circle right there. Come up on the top, straight diagonal up, straight diagonal down, come underneath, straight line, jump over, straight line and stop, do it again, straight line, jump over, straight line, connect. Okay, I think that's all. As always, we'll know when we color. Let's see how we're going to do that. Okay, the first thing we're going to do is we're going to color all of this helmet. This is his helmet. So if you have gray, that would be great to use on this section. This should be gray. This is a pike. This is a weapon. This should be gray. If you don't have gray, use your black lightly. So I, what I'm going to do is I'm going to use my black and do these other sections of his helmet. This is black. This is black. Colored lightly. This is black. And then color my buttons dark black. Color this section dark black of his helmet. The helmets are pretty intense. Then since I have my black out, I'm going to give him a black mustache. Okay, and this is also, this is his goatee, like a pointy beard. So I'm going to make that black. And this is his hair. So I'm going to make that black. Okay. Alright. Whoops, I did forget something. I knew I would. With your black we're just going to continue these lines up because this is the white rough of his collar. Just need to extend these lines. We're not going to color it. We're going to leave it alone. Just leave that alone. Then, if you have face color, these are his ears. So I did a dark tan. And this is all of his face. Now, if you don't have face color, you might want to use a brown very lightly and color this section in, okay? Then, I took my yellow and I did this section on his uniform yellow on the outside and I did his cross yellow. And then I took turquoise, blue-green, and I did the little baby circle right here and the little baby circle on the pike, his weapon, up there. Then, using brown, I colored in the wooden stake part of his pike, his weapon. Okay. Then, with blue, I colored in this section, and this is almost like his breastplate, chest plate of his uniform. So I did this dark blue and this inside section dark blue. Now the next part you can do red but I did not have a good red so I used my red violet to do these big plumy feathers he has on top of his helmet which probably look very impressive to the Aztecs or the other conquering indigenous people that the conquistadors took over. And then this section of his cloak, this is all red-violet. You could use red, that was the other option, but my red is, I need a new red. I have red, but it's not very good. Okay. I think that's all. Let's see what he looks like all colored in. Okay, here's my Spanish conquistador all colored in. Ready to conquer the new world. Okay, bye-bye.